Hello everyone, welcome to the video. So, in this video I just want to share that you and me and we all are joyful spirits. We're all playful, childlike, innocent, wise, empowered, holy, divine spirits, okay? Like our spirit, our nature, our heart, our spirit, our nature, our heart is very childlike, free, playful and innocent and creative with, a, with an innate sexual energy too. We, even the children, which is a creative force of creativity, co-creation and new creation into the world. So like some people say like, oh, you're a very happy spirit. I want to say we're all very happy spirits. So all we need to do is remove the gunk and get our thinking and focus and how we remember our perspective our imagination, our envisioning the future, our seeing things, our our minds, when we get that right, that's our vibration generator. That's how we create our emotions and that's how we get inspired or feel uninspired. That's how we get depressed or that's how we get joyful and exhilarated and happy. So when we get that right and then we work on the, the body aspect, when we declutter the body just like we declutter the mind, that's when we can have far more energy, which we can feel more inspired and be more playful and creative and we feel way happier when we cleanse and declutter the mind, the, the, the body, everyone also. So our body has a hundred trillion cells. Every cell is like a cup and there's also massive riverways of lymph and blood too. So we, if these are blocked and congested and sticky and contaminated with toxins and acids and inflammation, of course we're going to have massive reduction in spirited, our true spirited nature because of all the blocks. It's simple as that. I don't need to be a scientist to convince you of this. It's plain obvious. And that's why humans are so sick, unlike the wild animals who are bountiful, bountifully rich in, in youthful longevity. So... I've seen this in my own life extensively, everyone. And so everyone who eats a raw food diet or even steps up to a vegetarian or vegan diet, step up to a raw diet, step up to a simple food diet with less recipes and less condiments to a more simple diet, like all of nature eats. When you simplify, you will absolutely thrive. It's all about aligning with your spirit mentally and simplifying and healing and decluttering physically, as well as nourishing and connecting with nature, fresh air, exercise, enough rest and sleep so not too much or too little of any of the things i just mentioned not too much or too little sleep rest exercise connecting with nature barefoot and um, depending on the climate if it's cold or, or not or, or summer so when we do that and we get sunlight on the, our skin and our the air connected to our skin so less clothes is generally better you know within appropriate um, social settings and i sleep in the cold winter at the moment i'm sleeping with one window open you know before that, I had like two windows wide open and I also have my curtains wide open for maximum airflow, everyone. It's like I'm in a super deluxe tent. So this for everyone, this is this little video. I haven't told you how to do the mind correctly, but I've told you in lots of other videos. So check out my other live videos. And I, thanks for everyone for all your love and support and your shares for sharing this message. It's so simple and simple and simple and easy. All we need to do is get over the social conditioning, the brainwashing. God bless the beautiful Illuminati. I love the hell out of them. <laughs> I love these Illuminati. They've created a pretty good earth, like overall, like to be honest. Like it's not bad, like it's not that bad. It could be much worse, like even though it's pretty bad in some ways, but it's really amazing in other ways, you know? So all we need to do is see the truth and learn how to harness the power that we are. Like you're a very happy spirit. So just let go, of, let go and heal and let go. And listen to lovely music and use essential oils and possibly herbs like enemas or colonic irrigation, massage. Get, make friends, make a social, set, social structure for yourself, social network and community of like extended family or at least friends or social settings. And then you're gonna be like extremely happy everyone. Like honestly, you don't need to talk forever about this. That's like, I've given you like 90 95% of how to thrive in amazing health and life. Mentally, emotionally, physically, everyone, it's so simple. The original healing method was fasting. And I guess how simple that is, you stop doing stuff and you stop eating stuff. That's like reduction, it's not adding stuff in. It's allowing the body to heal, 
and getting yourself in a more of a meditative state to contemplate, reflect, and get your mind correct too. So everyone, I've been just fucking like feeling awesome this year. Uh, at least it started off difficult. It's imp- I went through a big healing, I went through emotional detox phase for like two and a half months. Then I went through, okay, I went through a big loss first. Oh, sorry, wait a minute. Start off 2017. Went through experiencing hope, dreams, and aspirations. Okay, family, new baby coming with my ex-girlfriend, ex, ex-lovely mother of our baby. Hit March, gone through loss, sort of <laughs> shaken up, rattled. Then followed by two and a half months of emotional detox from childhood traumas. Okay, moving on, hitting the summer, back in Ireland again. Um, going through integration and continued healing, the little the end parts of the healing and integration of my new self and the learning and growing and the integration of all my lessons in the newfound state of energetic flow and wellness after my big emotional detox for two and a half months. Moving on, back here in Ireland, solidifying everything, becoming more concrete, whole, bigger, higher vibrational, mastering my mind way more. You want to see this in my more recent live videos, like seriously harnessing and understanding the power of the mind and how it's a vi- our vibrational creator. It is the spring from which everything in our life comes from. It is fast energy. Physical reality is denser energy. It takes time to manifest what you first think and repeat and envision. So um, that's it, everyone. Now I'm in this place, kicking ass attracted and manifested a, a lovely lady into my life also who I highly resonate with and um, special connection there well um, just great for everything really in my life you know like if you want to attract a soulmate type of relationship you gotta be the mate of your soul first you gotta be like you gotta be vibing with your soul like you gotta be happy and single and not needing anyone and clingy you know you have to be learn to thrive so keep raising your vibration everyone this like i said in this video and thanks for all your love support sharing and caring and fun love and laughter such a good day it's every day is a blessing let us cherish we're all being guided for every end exit there's an entry somewhere else Don't worry about losses and coming and going. Live through love, not fear. Go where your heart calls you. Don't make decisions based on just fear alone, you know? The universe will always guide you and support you. Just keep trying to be your best and have this intention to be sincere, okay? And go for it. Life is there to be taken and grabbed. Don't let the opportunities go by because of fear. Swallow it up whole. Tear it apart. You have your whole team on you in spirit behind you the universe has your back don't worry about like unexpected things life is constant change don't worry about making new plans or or even like for example like some sort of promise or idea depending on what it is don't worry about changing new plans we life makes us have new desires by this by the day so go with your new highest excitement and desires that's calling you forth allow yourself to go through all different directions possibly if your heart changes direction it's okay to change plans go with the flow and trust you're going to be okay and support it at the end of the day you can fail following the comfort zone that's like stuff you don't like or you can fail following your heart and you're reaching for the stars you can still fail in your comfort zone living a boring life why not risk it? Because either way, you could fail anyway. So I hope that makes sense. Um, Angela says, what's the best treatment for arthritis? T- get your pure gum spirits of turpentine by Diamond Forest. Rub it on your knee or your arthritic places topically. Also get, um, um, what's it called? Um, BFC ointment from Dr. Christopher. I'll put... <laughs> I'll put links up above this video for both of these. Um, and you can also get the BFC bones flesh cartilage powder also. And finally, you can also try Eucomia Bark from my herb store, or you could try the Bones Formula um, from Bones and Giants Formula from my herb store too, higherselfherbs.com. So check out any of those links. And of course, stop eating an acidic diet, which is a meat flesh dairy decomposing animal diet etc 
decomposing breast milk diet. It's so congestive and acidifying. I highly recommend going on a vegan diet at least and upping up the salads and the raw foods and the fruitarian based diet. That'll get you better, pretty much. And um, peppermint essential oil can be very helpful too. So. You're welcome, Angela. Take care, everyone. Lots of love. Cherish, cherish the day. See you.